when you see that your acrylic brush has gotten like this shortly after using it it's such an easy fix the only couple of things you're going to be needing is going to be cuticle oil acetone and monomer and like a measuring cup i'm going to be using equal parts acetone and monomer you want equal parts because this will not work if you have more acetone or more monomer Once I have added equal parts of both, I'm then just going to submerge my brush fully into the solution. I see a lot of other videos telling people to completely leave the brush for 20 to 15 minutes, 30 minutes, however long. I think the acetone is a little bit too abrasive to be doing that to your acrylic brush. This entire process took me 5 minutes like literally five minutes to do it didn't take me having to soak anything i'm submerging my brush i'm spinning it around i'm really dunking and changing size for my brush i'm only doing this to help that acrylic that is stuck break apart that way it just becomes easier to wipe off onto my lint free wipe Already with this time that's passed, you see how my brush has softened up tremendously. Now I'm just going to be taking my fingers and trying to rub in between the bristles, breaking up some of that acrylic. It is really still caked in there, so I'm going to be dipping my brush once again into the solution, trying to soften it up. Once I see that my brush is ready, I'm taking a cuticle pusher and very lightly scraping that acrylic out of the brush. This acrylic I use had some glitter flakes in it, so I'm also catching those. I know that if I were to apply a lot more pressure, I could have this acrylic out of here in two seconds. The goal for me is to keep my brush intact. The goal isn't just to hurry up and get the acrylic out. So I'm just lightly scraping, whatever comes out, comes out. If it doesn't come out, I'll be taking the solution back once again, submerging, and then trying this process over. Once I dip my final time, I'm just going to be checking my brush once again with my cuticle pusher and getting those last small chunks of acrylic. Once I feel like I've gotten everything, I'm going to check the brush one more time. You can see it looks like a completely different brush already, like quite literally. Now I'm going to be taking a new lint-free wipe and some cuticle oil. I see a lot of people telling people to put the cuticle oil directly on the brush. I do not want cuticle oil in the back handle of my brush because that means that oil is always going to be staying in there. And that could further ruin my application when I'm laying acrylic. So just wiping your brush onto a cotton round or lint-free wipe that has cuticle oil on it is going to rehydrate the brush once again and give it its shape.
And that is my two cents on how to keep your acrylic brush clean from acrylic. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. Leave any comments down below, things you want to see, and don't forget to subscribe. Bye!